why am I holding up this iPad and this Funko Pop of Seaman LeBoner of Duran Duran? Because we about to get our 80s on with the Positive Grid Spark right here on Geargasms. Wait, no, no, how do we go? No. Jesus. It just goes on and on. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Geargasms. I'm your host, Alan Barnes. Today, we got the Positive Grid Spark. We're going back to that same well, the Old Man Spark. We've got Simon LeBone of Duran Duran. What is Old Man Spark? You're probably asking yourself, and I'm going to tell you in just a second. But first, if you're new to the channel, I'd like to beg you to like and subscribe. This channel is kind of like current season Saturday Night Live. If you're able to watch it all the way to the end, you're guaranteed to hear at least one joke. Celebrate mediocrity. Now, Old Man Spark is a series where I, I take the spark and we use the AI. We pull up a band, songs I've heard but I've not necessarily played, and we see if the spark AI can teach this old man how to play the catalog of some of the greats. And this time, we are featuring one of the greats from the 80s, Duran Duran. I know y'all are just, just frothing at the mouth to get into this, and that was a really awkward way to phrase that, so let's just roll right into it. Alrighty, rig of the day is this here Paul Stanley PS120 Ibanez. I, I figured I wanted to pick something to sort of butch up this Duran Duran adventure we're about to go on a little bit, so I, I went for the hyper-masculine Paul Stanley of KISS. Spark, millennial lead, it's a built-in tone. That's what we're gonna rock on. I know it'll sound awful on some of these songs, but it helps keep the copyright police away. Let's get some. I took the liberty, as always, of bringing up some Duran Duran in advance. And it looks like they pretty much got the catalog. Let's do this one. That's a favorite. Wait a minute, that ain't right. That first part's right. That'll test your intonation, won't it? Brother, this guy stinks! Oh, that was pretty slick, though, that. That's probably the best way to do it. Oh, here's my part. Wait a minute. Oh, that Andy, you're tricky, weren't you? He was tricky. So that's Girls on Film. I think we handled that with aplomb. This was the one that I really liked right away. Please, please tell me Quick story. I went and saw Duran Duran in 1985 with a friend of mine because we heard all these girls are going to be there. Sorry, Simon. Just like the Beatles, just like the Beatles, they were right. Them girls were all like 11 to 14, and we're 20, dude. Pulled that sharp on purpose, just to fool the, the copyright police. But while I'm here, I thought so. There's no A in there. Damn it. No, it's not that. Just like... Go straight to the D. Just like Du Bois and Duran. Duran. At least now. Oh, 
Oh, man. I was going for that rock star move. You'll have to forgive that. But you get the gist of that one. Ah, uh, y'all got excited. Get real. We're still doing Duran Duran. Aww. Wild boys. Wild boys. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, see, it's wrong, it's wrong. You see, it took us to A, it had it going. Wild boy sango. Oh, that might actually be right. I'm sorry, Spark. Busted. <laughs> Don't ever listen to me. I still think you can put a D there every now and again, and I know Nick would agree with me. Now I was doing a very, very musical trick there for y'all. It's the whole thing's E minor, but you voice the first strum of it with the major, just the fifth, you go. Then finish out with. Same thing with the B. It's a minor, you just hit the fifth. Let's go to Rio, baby. We'll stay on the same album. We'll, we'll get hungry like that wolf. Oh, hungry like the wolf. <laughs> I know what y'all are thinking. The chords are right on the screen, son. Why won't you look? I've just lost in them. I'm trying to find that. Fret number matters, apparently. Fret number matters. Stop the recording. You can hungry me like your wolf. Let's do the gag reflex. I ain't even ashamed to admit it. I just got my ass kicked there by that one. So let's not do the reflex. Maybe I shouldn't have made that joke. Let's try this one. Maybe it's cooler than I remember. This is one of my frustrations with the Spark where they just pull from uh, YouTube. Some, any old dipshit could have posted this on YouTube and hence the volumes can be wildly different, and I think I'm maxed here. You know the Could it be the whole we dance into the fire.
Here's the problem. When, when we saw Duran Duran live, Andy Taylor is actually a good guitarist, and you could tell at this point in Duran Duran, he had sort of checked out. Uh, we'll just say Andy was on the scissor. That purple drank. Don't <laughs> What Andy was sipping on. All right, let's go soft. Trying to come to a club where people wear on each other. Another down low one, bro. It's so low. Let me see if I can fix. Oh, Simon. What the F? No! I'm doing the wrong thing. Let's look at these chords again, bro. I'll do credit to Nick here. His keyboard part is the best guitar part in the song, man. That's the hook. That was Nick with the wiggle stick. That's what she <laughs> said. No, no, no. Damn, man, is there anything left that's good? Did we do it all? Oh, we didn't do New Moon on Monday. Maybe this will be decent. <laughs> this ain't good. Come on, say bye. Yes, nothing butches up of a uh, friendly video like a little bit Francais. Uh oh, I hear a little Duran noise. Let the record reflect, that was so wrong. Come on, Spark Boys, that was so wrong. The Mrs. Geargasms would get mad if I don't do this one. I gotta come in and in defense of these chords. I'm not trying to get all like Beato on you, but yeah, yeah, these are some really, really super beautiful turnarounds. Even with this sloppy shitty uh, tone and my sloppy shitty uh, playing, it still sounds sweet. All right, I will admit, I'll admit, I'm glad I did that one. What did we learn today? We learned that some of those early Duran Duran songs had some pretty decent guitar playing. 
We also learned that Duran Duran songs, maybe a couple records later, and he was on the cocaine and, and maybe taking too much of that purple scissor. Them songs, not so much. Oh, man. And finally, we learned that all these Johnny Come Latelys and his Beato boys heaping all this praise on Ordinary World, it's legit. As always, I thank you for the time that you spend with the channel. Please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Tell some of your ratchet ass, moochie, ghetto, government cheese eating, Section 8 friends about gear guys. You know they're going to fit right in here perfectly. We got merch. Are you going to buy any? All hell's naw. But it, I, it gives me something to say at the end of the video. Whatever you do in the next seven days, don't tell Ray and Dave Davies about it. No one wants to watch two old men going at it. And if they do, there's already a website for that. It's Britney, bitch. But play more guitar. Watch less of this. Keep coming back here week after week for more Geargasms.